Welcome beauties. Today's video, I am, I am on a skincare journey as well as a health and fitness journey. I've been eating a little bit differently for a while now. So I've decided since I haven't seen any changes in my skin, even though I've been trying to be better about what I put into my body, I know I've always struggled with acne no matter what I was doing when I was in high school and I ate well and I was an athlete and I still struggled with acne. So I'm just on a journey to try and find something to help with this. And a lot of this is from wearing a mask. Um, it gets a lot worse because my skin is so sensitive when I go out. Um, so sorry, she's just gonna keep trying to move the stack of water a case of 40 water bottles. So I just happened upon a Jamie French video where she was reviewing products and she said something about um, some product that was helping her heal her broken capillaries and everything on her face. And it sounds so gross and it grosses me out to the umph of this, just, oh my word, the umph degree. I can't I've tried to order these products before and I ended up not doing it because it would gross me out, but it's by the brand Farmstay. One was a 100% aloe vera gel, which I got because I love aloe. I love aloe vera. I use it for a lot of things um, in the summertime when my family has burns or when I do waxing, I like to use aloe gel for the cooling gel instead of what comes with your kit when you start waxing. I'm waiting for her to walk and she can stand, squat, do all that stuff, but she will not take a step for the life of her. It's so yellow. I think I'm gonna stay, stay here. We're gonna stay right here, you can see me. So it is Snail Pure Cleansing Foam. This is what it looks like. I will link it down below as well as the yellow so you guys can um, purchase that if you'd like. So I'm just gonna wash my face today. It's my first day of washing my face with this. And so you're just gonna see about a week of progress if it's done anything. I think that I'm gonna use my retinol serum and probably like a moisturizer of some sort, um, but I'm not quite sure yet. I wanted to get the moisturizer in this brand that was also snail to just kind of double it up and see if if I saw results any differently. Maybe that's a future video, but let's get going. Let's wash here. I am going to show you guys um, a before video of my skin, a close up, a very uncomfortable close up, so you guys can actually see the bumps on my face and how how textured my skin really is and we'll see if that changes afterwards all right so i'm just gonna do like a tiny that looks like a lot but we'll see how it foams up a little bit I like to go upwards on my cheeks and cross and up and around. I'm just trying not to think about the product that I'm putting on my face right now. And now we rinse. I'm rinsing with pretty cold water just so y'all know. Um, I typically do, it closes the pores on your face. Like as cold as I can stand. Oh my God, I'm at all. <sighs> and as you can see how sensitive my face really is after washing. Now today, I am kind of hating that I started this today because um, I have to put a ton of makeup on. I have a photo shoot today and 
I hate that I'm like using a new product, seeing how it like works, but I guess this is the ultimate test of how it really is gonna work on my skin because a lot of times when I put makeup on, it kind of resets my skin and it just doesn't end well the next day when I wake up, I have like more zits. So I try not to, even though I put moisturizer and um, layer a lot of stuff on my skin before I put the makeup over my face, it still has a negative effect on my face. So I try not to put makeup on as much as possible, but today I can't really avoid it. All right, so it has been a week and I am slacking on videos so bad. It's actually been over a week because dealing with a sick teething baby is not easy. And that has had all my attention, but I have still been doing my same skin regimen with the uh, farm stay wash. And honestly, after a couple days, I noticed that my face where I was breaking out and I am on my period right now, so it's very hormonal. <laughs> um, and I noticed that it didn't hurt this time when I got my period. And usually it's very, it's painful. I can't lay on it. It hurts. It has like smoothed down and I don't know if you guys can see that texture, but like, Holy moly. I must say I was very skeptical on using this face wash, but I'm glad I did because I think honestly, overall it has repaired a lot of damage that I had and hopefully you guys can see that in the video. So it has prevented a lot of breakouts from happening because by this point, usually this is so flared up and I've been wearing makeup and a mask a lot this week. So honestly, I recommend it. But anyway, I hope that this helped you to decide if you want to try out this whole snail trend or not and that this was just helpful to you if you are suffering from painful acne um i can't do a lot of prescription um face washes and stuff right now even curology but that's coming soon but i am still breastfeeding so when you're breastfeeding they don't recommend it for you it is very drying um so you're gonna want like a heavier moisturizer um, unless you have super oily skin and this might actually balance you out a little bit so go ahead and leave a comment down below if there's any products that you have tried out or want to try out that you think i should use or that you want me to use and do an experiment to show you if it works or not on my skin honestly my skin is so sensitive so problematic so i'm i guarantee if you want to know if it works and it works on my skin it probably works so but to end this out i hope you guys are having a great day and just remember i am not a doctor nor a dermatologist so don't use this as like me telling you to do it i'm just recommending that it worked for me and showing you guys what, what worked for me just because it worked for me it might not work for you um so go ahead and play around and try and find what works for you or talk to your doctor if it's something super serious or super painful for you and yeah i hope you have a great day